Prints are uncomfortable, being used by media as the eyes of royal commentator deal. US TV networks are reportedly luring Prince Harry with multi-million dollar deals to host their coverage of King Charles III's coronation. The Duke of Sussex may be comfortable being used as a tool by the media if it means he lands commentator job for King Charles's coronation. A royal commentator told the Express that, you know, there is a natural curiosity surrounding Harry, they said, which he may use to his advantage if he has something to say. This could lead to the royal to turn down an invitation to attend the crowning of his father in favor of commentating on it, you know, in front of the camera. Ron Torresian, founder of and chairman of the 5W Public Relations, told Express.co.uk After the media frenzy to promote your Netflix documentary and Harry's book, I believe we will still see less of the successes for the time being. Harry has said that he wanted to stay, or he wanted to say, and he will make himself scarce leading up to the coronation, giving everyone a much needed break from the ex royals while also building suspense onto those last moments, wondering whether he will or won't be in attendance. He added, There is a natural curiosity surrounding Harry from hardcore fans to peripheral onlookers who will want to see how he will spend coronation day. However, can secure commentary from Harry is going to be able to drive incredible traffic and Harry may be comfortable being used as a tool if he has something to say. According to highly placed studio sources within the US TV industry, some massive multi-million dollar offers could be on the table for Harry to join a broadcast team. Networks CBS and NBC are thought to be leading the pack in chasing the Californian-based royal to join their reporting teams. CBS aired the infamous Oprah Winfrey interview with Harry and Meghan after the step down from the royal duties. Earlier this month, Harry also appeared on the station again to promote his new book while also making some shocking revelations about the firm. Should the Duke take up the commentator offer, the royal family should be concerned, the PR expert warned. Mr. Torosian said, should Harry choose to join in the commentary around the coronation, the family should be concerned that he will pull back the curtain on the public's perception of the events, the glamour, the mystery that was has historically accompanied the palace and you know, share hidden and behind the scenes details that they would rather keep quiet. Not to mention, if Harry cannot find a way to attend the coronation, whether because he doesn't receive an invite nor the apology he's seemingly still waiting for to today, um, he has an opportunity to further build support and gather sympathy, opening more doors and opportunities for him to speak on this experience further. An insider told the Sunday Express that network bosses are hoping he doesn't go and are ready to pay a hefty seven-figure sum to land one of the biggest royal coups of all time. One several senior executive told me it would be worth $5 million for the bragging rights alone. Watching a new king being crowned while his son is on the couch, talking viewers through it would be ratings dynamite, even if Harry stares completely clear of controversy and the rift that exists between them. King Charles III's coronation will take place on Saturday, May 6 at Westminster Abbey in London. Buckingham Palace said, um, as although the coronation will be rooted in long-standing traditions, it will also reflect the monarch's role today and look towards the future. The three-day event from May 6 to May 8 is expected to co include several impressive performances in an attempt to lift the nation's spirit following the winter of strikes and energy price hikes. It is understood King Charles 24 has been or has been keen for Harry to be on the guest list for the big day, but it is still not clear whether this will be possible.